I think this will be my seat. Sheldon, do you have anything to say that has anything to do with, you know, what I'm talking about? Well, let's see. We might consider Schrodinger's cat. Schrodinger? Is that the woman in 2A? No, that's Mrs. Grossinger. And she doesn't have a cat. She has a Mexican hairless, annoying little animal. Yep, yep, Sheldon! <laughs> Sorry, you diverted me. Anyway, in 1935, Erwin Schrodinger, in an attempt to explain the Copenhagen interpretation of quantum physics, he proposed an experiment where a cat is placed in a box with a sealed vial of poison that will break open at a random time. Now, since no one knows when or if the poison has been released, until the box is opened, the cat can be thought of as both alive and dead. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't get the point. Well, of course you don't get it. I haven't made it yet. <laughs> you have to be psychic to get it, and there's no such thing as psychic. Sheldon, what's the point? Just like Schrodinger's cat, your potential relationship with Leonard right now can be thought of as both good and bad. It is only by opening the box that you'll find out which it is. OK, so you're saying I should go out with Leonard? No, 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 no. <laughs> Let me start again. In 1935, <laughs> Erwin Schrodinger...